All right, Coach. Uh, it's a little bit of a tougher day today, but uh, you know, give me your your thoughts, your lessons, takeaways from today. Takeaways to from today is, uh, I mean, I think you know we we see. The guys that are wrestling Greco on a consistent basis are uh, winning matches. You know, we got two medals yesterday. Um, those guys are pretty much completely immersed in, in Greco Roman programs. Uh, Taylor's been doing it for a long time. You know, Hancock just started, but uh, you know, he, he he's in the right environment. He's at the Olympic Training Center. He's been there just about two years now, um, full time Greco environment. Uh, only wrestled uh, two years before that, but you know, I I, I think. Uh, Again, you know, it's the same narrative, you know, we're, we're bouncing around, we're switching styles a lot if we want to get really good. I mean, we get some good guys. I mean, uh, Mike Rogers, very tough, athletic guy, strong heavyweight. Um, you know, he just doesn't spend enough time training back with Roman. Uh, same thing with uh, Nick Renan, uh, phenomenal athlete, super scrappy, uh, willing to take risks, but uh, just didn't get his body in the right positions today a couple times. and. Uh, you know, the part there killed him. You know, he got in trouble there. He got taken down, boom, boom. He got turned twice. Uh, then he went for a risky maneuver when he was uh, behind. It was just, uh, you know, it was hard to watch, you know. And then the, uh, the other two guys, uh, Dalton today, um, yeah, he was wrestling out there. He was, he was scrapping. Uh, a little bit of a um, disappointment there because uh, I really felt like we were going to get past that Italian. And then... Uh, you know, we have the uh, Georgian next. Even if we even if we lose that kid, he's in the finals. Uh, mm -hmm. If we don't lose to him, you know, we, we take that path and we're in the finals. That was a it was a really good draw for Dalton. I think we missed that that opportunity. Just some some technical mistakes there. Um, Dearman just that kid just started. I mean, he, he's got he's gotten a lot better in, in a year. Uh, last year he didn't win a match at the World Team Trials, and uh, this year he was on a World Team. So it's one step at a time for some of these younger athletes. Uh, well, you know, they're moving in the right direction, too, um, along with our program moving in the right direction. So I guess this last thing would be sum up the trip as a whole, you know, the experience with the guys, the team, what, what uh, you know, taking this back to the States, how do you feel about it? Um, well, I think, you know, coming away with two medals this year was very exciting, mm -hmm. um, you know, and I, I think we can improve on that. You know, Tracy Hancock got a, got a bronze medal this year. He's got one more year. Taylor Lamont got a bronze medal. He's got two more years of juniors. So our, our team's young. Um, Dalton's done, uh, Jamal's done, everybody else is still, uh, you know, can come back uh, next year and uh, give this a shot. I hope they're, they're getting international tournaments in between that. I know the guys that are up in northern Michigan are training international and they're competing internationally and same thing with the guys that are training out in Colorado Springs. The rest of the guys, we might not see them until, uh, you know, next year at the trials, unfortunately. Um, so I mean I, I think there's some some really positive stuff there. Um, I know you know I know that uh, you know I think the disappointing part is that you know some of our best Greco-Roman athletes aren't going to be competing Greco-Roman until I see them at the trials next year. And you know, but I know guys like Taylor Lamont will be he'll be in uh, training Greco-Roman along with this college. Uh, so I don't think it's the optimal situation, but it's uh, it's better than him not you know wrestling Greco. Awesome. Perfect. All right. Thanks, Coach.